Hi, hello everyone, and welcome to this special um, session. Today is the solstice, summer solstice, so happy summer solstice to everyone around the world. And this session is just trying to um, be open to the messages from the angels and seeing what are the themes for all of us for this summer. Um, and as you can see, I created this altar for everyone um, with flowers, again, from my mom's garden because I love using her flowers, and some of my crystals, and I've used um, these cards from the goddess deck, and it's Cordelia, and she's a Celtic um, goddess, and she is a fairy goddess so she's related to the fairies and to the flowers so I wanted her to help us to bloom as many beautiful things as we can during the summer and then here we have Kuan Yin and she is a, a Buddhist goddess a Buddhist deity and I want her to bless us this summer with a lot of compassion and I want her to kind of challenge us to be more compassionate in our daily lives because I feel it's all about keeping it simple that's kind of like what I want the angels and the guides to do is give us simple messages that we could use in our daily life and that we could remember and honor and here I also have um, Butterfly Maiden and she is a um, Native American uh, goddess and she represents cycles and as you know, we are going into a new cycle, and she represents transformation. So I want her to bless us with transformation. And Kuan Yin, of course, compassion, and Cordelia, um, the flowers, nature, going outside. So may all of these beautiful goddesses bless us. So let's see what the angels have to say. What are the themes that we should focus on? Um, during the summer that could help us get ready and prepare for the next cycle. So I'm going to pick three cards and those are going to be the three themes and again trying to keep it simple. Here we have fresh air. So it says your body needs refreshment from oxygenated air generated by grass, trees, plants, and flowers. Spend time outside today as near to Mother Nature's cradle as possible. Open your curtains and windows to refresh your home as well. So here, this beautiful message um, for the summer is really enjoy yourself being outdoors. Receive the freshness that nature could provide to you, especially if you're in locations where you have winter. You know, take advantage of being outside and knowing that you could get some air, some sun, receive this loving energy from nature. And I feel that nature wants to help heal you. So this is a good message. And again, keeping it simple. So during the summer, enjoy the outdoors. Enjoy nature. So let's see what the next theme is. Here it says ground yourself. And it says, when you detach from awareness of your body and the physical world, you become ungrounded. Although it's pleasant to float heavenward, your attention and work are needed upon the earth. We're helping you to balance spiritual and material so that you can enjoy a fulfilling earthly life. Wow, this is powerful. And I say this because grounding yourself, I feel that they're preparing us, right? And I'm trying to get messages that are going to help us for the next cycle we're going to go through and I feel that um, the angels and everyone else is saying it is okay that you are transforming and that you're receiving a lot but don't forget that all of these things that you're getting are for the earth are for humanity are so that we could make it into a reality now so in other words balance yourself and ground yourself don't lose yourself. We don't want to lose you, especially if you have amazing new insights and gifts to share with others. So keep in mind during the summer is you want to balance yourself and ask the angels for help. And I, I'm going to repeat this again. The angels say, we're helping you balance the spiritual and material so that you can enjoy a fulfilling earthly life. 
So don't feel so stressed. The theme for this card is ground yourself, right? Balance and knowing that you could ask for help so that you know you can enjoy more of life. So thank you, angels. That's a very good message for everyone so we can have a great summer and again preparing for what's ahead and let's see what the third theme is for all of us Ooh, I'm gonna get chills or I'm getting chills really I'm this is life's purpose so this is the last theme that the angels and the divine um, beings out there want us to focus on and life purpose says the purpose of your life is to serve in a way that brings great joy to yourself and others. Don't worry about finding your purpose. Instead, focus upon serving the purpose. Then your purpose will serve you. So during the summer, I know that the angels want you to enjoy the outdoors, have fun. But they say that another thing for the summer is don't be afraid of getting into something that might be different, might be new. Um, it is about following your life purpose. So during the summer, don't ignore your dreams, your goals, these projects that are coming up or will come up for you during the summer. And the angels are preparing us because they say that all of us are going to connect to our divine purpose more than ever. So if you're like, well, I'm not getting it, you're going to get it. And that's why I say during the summer, go ahead and be of purpose because it's going to connect to your life purpose. So whatever it is that you're curious and serving, that's connected to your life purpose. So during the summer, allow that to enter your life. Allow this illumination and know that your life purpose connecting to it is very vital for what's going to happen next, which is this transformation, this um, enlightenment that really is for everyone, for all parts of the world. So thank you again for being with me, and um, I hope you enjoyed the messages. I hope that you receive um, clarity, right? And know that you are an amazing spiritual being here on Earth, and I thank you for all that you've done. And have a great, beautiful, safe summer. And again, Colleen Cordelia, Kuan Yin, Butterfly Maiden, and all the angels and our ancestors should bless our summer um, so we can have an amazing summer and of course so we could be prepared for what follows after that bye bye have an amazing day happy summer solstice love